What's good, y'all? It is 3.39 a.m. And uh, we are getting ready to go to Fort Worth. So I had to come back to the shop and get mics and also my tripod. And uh, we'll be on our way. So y'all stay tuned, be on the lookout. Um, gonna be teaching, teaching a class today with my boy Tank. But we got the tripod and the mics. Let's get to Forward Barber Supply Amarillo where we're meeting up and then head to uh, Forward Barber Supply in Fort Worth. So I'm really tired. I got like three hours of sleep. I'm super nervous, um, but it's just gonna be a great time. But uh, let's get to it. See y'all in a few. Look, I just flipped the switch. We just made the Forward Barber Supply. It is four o'clock and we headed out. Just got gas. My boy Davey in the cut. What's good? Zaza. And Marky Mark. And I guess we the Funky Bunch. This man slept the whole way. We just made it, well rested. Zaza executive gang out here. We got uh, both owners of Fort Worth Barber Supply back there, Edward and Mark. And then we got my boy Tank in the tundra. But let's get inside and uh, get these pre-show vibes vibing. We got Edward here for Forward Barber Supply. Yeah, what's up guys? Thanks for coming out this morning. It's gonna be a great class. We're really looking forward to it. Anytime we can get Jay, you know, involved, man, we're very appreciative. If you don't know, Jay was there from day one at our first class. We even announced we were opening for a barber supply. You probably thought we were just some little corner in the back of a barber shop, but uh, <laughs> that's what it was at that time. So uh, anyway, Jay, thanks for coming down, man. We appreciate it. And appreciate the support. I appreciate you, brother. Let's take a look at the store, y'all. Got everything over here. TV screens, got all the chairs set up. Got my boy, Davey. La Chopperita. And time to get Tank up in the building, get him on the vlog. We know we gotta bombard him with the camera. Hello. What's up? How's it going? Good, good, good. Hey, hey. We got Tank. What's good, man? What's good? Y'all say what's up to Jay Blend's channel. Hey, Jay Blend's channel. What do you call your channel? Your people. I think it's just, no, but what do you call your the, people? The Jay Blenders. The Jay, the Jay Blenders. <laughs> Jay Blenders. This guy right here, man, he's been putting uh, in work. I want to say I appreciate you for coming out. Up, I know you're going to drop some gems. So we're dropping gems today, man. Y'all get with it. But I got to follow this guy. So <laughs> I don't know. But he's ready, though. Right, man. Take, man. We're in here behind the scenes, the warehouse. Let's go. Cheers to the class. Get it. We're missing Cuffalo, Dre, and Barbara June. But where y'all at, man? Where, where they at? at? More behind the scenes, my boy's got his presentation all queued up. Got it on the screens here. Looking real professional. He's so prepared, bro. Hey, if we're going to provide information, man, I want to do it, you know what I'm saying, to where people can watch it visually and then they can hear me. It's not just one thing. How long you been working on it? On and off, about a couple of weeks. Oh, okay. I would only do maybe like an hour or two a day. And really, it wasn't... Uh, creating what to put on to the thing that took forever. It was trying to figure out, cause I did it all on my phone. Yeah. That's my first time doing one on my phone with this app. So it was just trying to figure out how I wanted to lay out is what took longer than actually putting the information up there. Do you know hard to, to use? No, no, it's, it's, no? Super, it's like click and drag type Boom. stuff. It's pretty easy, bro. So with this being a content creation class for future content creators out there, oh, there you go. Um, Keynote, you have tools on your phone that can help you to yes, get to the where you want to get. So we got them up there, boom. We got Kevin here doing all the filmography and the photography. What can they follow you at, bro? Uh, KLE1127 or my videography account, Lee Media. We're gonna make some dope content with Tank Be Chopping, you know what I'm saying? Y'all go follow the boy right there. <laughs> so if y'all remember my vlog from a couple months ago, we got Cherry here. Let's go. I was invited out to the Five Star Barber Expo. Appreciate the invite. And uh, when's it going down again? It's going down next year in March of 2024. Boom, there it is. Y'all pull up to San Antonio. Hey, appreciate the local barber brand right here. 
Uh, appreciate the, the merchandise we got here. Got a hat and a shirt. You want to yeah. plug your Instagram, man? All at us. It's uh, Bishop Cuts right here for barbering, and it's a local barber brand. Apparel marketing for you. All at me. Hey, go follow. <laughs> Raw take out last year, uh, doing class and like, hey, you guys come check it out. We do some pretty cool things, you know. I thought we were doing some pretty cool things. And uh, he's like, yeah, 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 I'll make it. I'm like, cool. So we came out and really got to know he and his wife, Tanya. And, uh, and I was like, look, you need me at all, we're here for it. You know, we knew he was going to grow and he just blow up. Uh, we are you know, excited he was just down the road, kind of about four hours from us, you know. Uh, anytime you've got some local talent there, you want to really try to foster that talent. And I'm, and I'm not just talking about, uh, you know, YouTubers. I'm talking about even guys in your own barbershop. You, know? you want to just let them flourish and just help them grow. And that's, I was like, whatever you need, we're here. So, uh, it's, this is a big deal to us, you know. And I don't want to uh, not mention Jay, because, man, Jay. So, if you don't know, when we first announced Woo! Fort Barber Supply, we actually had a class with a guy named Sean Cutsier at our barbershop. Uh, and Jay drove all the way from Amarillo, and uh, and I didn't know who he was. I'm like, man, that's cool. I, I thought he was just a guy around the corner. I was like, hey, good to meet you. And uh, later I found out he had his blog and his YouTube thing, and I was like, wow, this is really cool. Uh, he made the drive five and a half hours, did a little vlog on us. And at the time, we were we had a, a table like this <laughs> in the back of our barbershop. And uh, I was like, oh, man, I really hope that that's not what he thinks we are. But uh, this is what we had envisioned, you know. Uh, everything on a larger scale, uh, and he goes back and does a video, and I'm like, man, you really can't complain about the exposure. These guys are just putting in work and growing their audience, and, and we're so thankful for it. So thank you, Jay, for being there from day yes, one. Sir. Yes, sir. Uh, if you don't know, he's in Amarillo, like I said, and he and Mark, the owner from Amarillo, for which Mark is the gentleman right here, uh, they are teaming up to do some cool stuff in Amarillo. So if you guys are anywhere near West Texas, make the trip, go out there, go support those guys. Uh, they're doing, they're going to be doing the same stuff we're doing. So we're excited for those guys. But anyway, thank you for coming out. We got Tank be chopping. Are you ready? I'm ready, man. I'm ready. Let's get it. Give him a big. Over the Woo! What's good, forward? If y'all can't from any other spot, I'm going to say what's good, forward, because we're in Fort Worth. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to say what's good, forward. But what's good, everybody in the building? I appreciate y'all for coming out. Uh, we're going to be going over content creation and social media beyond the chair. But this is the type of content right here that will get clients in your chair. So you have a before, you have a during, and you're gonna show the complete transformation of the haircut. And by doing videos like this, you'll, you're able to captivate people who want to sit in your chair. To build your platform to grow clientele, you also want to be, what I used was hashtags. So if you, wherever you're from, you want to uh, use local hashtags, like local businesses around you. Uh, for me, we're in Amarillo, Texas. So in Amarillo, Texas, we have the Cadillac Ranch. We have a minor league team uh, called the Sod Poodles. So all these things I've used as hashtags and by using those hashtags, it remains local. Uh, negativity from people that have an opinion about every little thing. And for me, uh, you just have to learn to brush it off. And at first, they deter you from your end goal because that it's gonna hinder you. Nobody wants to hear like, oh, that haircut strap, or oh, you push that dude back. And that, that right there is gonna be like, man, like why am I even posting this <coughs> anymore? But, I feel like you should continually post stuff from the start, no matter where you're starting at with your social media, because it helps you to gauge, it gives you a reference point from where you started to where you want to get. We all fail to realize is that like, barbering is like one big old family. Like there's enough heads out there to cut for everybody. And collaboration can only help your business grow even more. Um, collaborating with Ford Barber Supply, uh, where I'm at in Amarillo, we're gonna put on a show, uh, a barber competition, and that's just trying to get people to come together because ego is gonna be the downfall of anybody. So make sure you're trying to collaborate and it only makes you have a bigger net to, to get more followers, like takes it. Ideas for different content. How many people go through like so many different scenarios in the barbershop daily? Like, you, 
get annoying clients, you get kids because you get all types of things that could be content. One of them was uh, one way for me that I grew a large following as well is staying relevant to like things that happen in pop culture. So say you have like a, a fight, uh, a boxing match, or you have uh, when Will Smith slapped uh, Chris Brown. Uh, not Chris Brown. Chris Brown. <laughs> so Will Smith slapped Chris Rock. I made a barber meme out of that, and a bunch of people shared that. I think it was like. I don't even remember what it was, but it had something to do with clients not booking a haircut somehow, I tied that in. But by tying in relevant things that are happening at that moment, you, and it pretending to barbering will get barbers to, you know, have a, a laugh off of it and have people to follow you for that. This is a day one supporter right here. We got Carlos here. What's up, what's up? Lo, know. Make sure you go follow him. Lo, you know, I'm gonna put it somewhere right here so y'all can go follow him. Hey, but, appreciate hey, you, day one. Appreciate you, brother. Yes, I love watching this man grow. He's definitely uh, one of my top ten favorite barbers in the industry. Yeah, I appreciate, so, yeah. I appreciate that, bro. Yeah, that's that's you, fact, bro. That's yes, fact. Sir. Yo, we so we just something. we just got done with the class. Tank did his thing. Let's go, boy. Uh, and just a lot of dope uh, engagement for the class. But Tank's gonna be in Amarillo the hey, 23rd, man, yes, sir. The 23rd. Hey, look, we, that's we the plan. If, if I don't make it, it's my fault. I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all now. If I don't make it, it's my fault. But Jay said we're gonna manifest it. We manifest so it. We, we gonna manifest it. Uh, J June, July, July 23rd. July 23rd. They want me in Amarillo. Uh, they got an event coming. What's the name of the event? The name of the event is just gonna be uh, Tank Barber Battle. <laughs> <laughs> They're trying to entice me. They're trying to entice me. Uh, well, hey, y'all heard it. We're gonna try to make it work, man. So y'all stay tuned. It's going down. Let's yeah. get it. How are ya? Class is done. Time to go get some grub. We're gonna go to the social house. It was Liddy. Mark's been awesome driving. I'm hungry. <laughs> oh no. Let's get it. We out here, Cubezilla. Got a grub. Tank. Alright, get out tequila face. Uh. <laughs> All right, y'all, it's been real. Uh, we headed back to Amarillo. It is 531. Uh, Social House was a good spot to eat at. Uh, shout out to the gang for coming through to the class. That's gang. Uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed the class. I'm trying to edit this on the way home, so. It is 1055, just got back to Amarillo. We are here, back here at Four Up Barber Supply. It was a great time, a great class, great time linking up with Tank and all them. And uh, it's just been a, uh, a great opportunity. Shout out to Fort Bar Supply and Fort Worth for uh, allowing me the opportunity. It was, uh, it was good, it was good. It's got more stuff coming, so just stay tuned. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. If you're not subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button, smash that like button, turn your post notifications. Until next time, God bless.